now? Where are the Democratic governors? Where are the blue state leaders? Who is setting the national tone around what's possible if we reject Ron DeSantis's brand of authoritarianism? That has been my question as we've been battling this AP African American Studies issue. Where are the Democratic governors coming together and saying they will not accept a course that has been whitewashed and propagandized to massage the feelings of a narcissist in Florida? And I like that you rightly point out that this is not just a Florida problem because I see the memes. I see Bugs Bunny sawing us off and sending us into the Atlantic Ocean, and that's cute, but that's not how politics works. And it's worth saying out yeah. loud that Ron DeSantis is animated by a desperation to be president of the United States. So if you're made uncomfortable by the way in which books are being banned in Florida, imagine giving him the keys to the United States Department of Education. If you're made uncomfortable by his racism yeah. and xenophobia, Imagine him with unlimited resources to traffic migrants across the country or whitewash and propagandize black history, not just in Florida, but in all 50 states. Ron DeSantis is not just a Florida problem. He is a national crisis that is threatening freedom and democracy. And the question, as you posed, is when is someone going to finally stand up, push back against him and organize a resistance that says this is what's possible if we choose the path forward instead of the regressive path back? 